Hey everybody, it's Kirby Drop, and I'm back, baby. Yes, I am back, and here is another wonderfully exciting, fantastic episode of Let's Play Chrono Trigger, episode 7. I'm using the title screen here as a buffer to introduce the episode. Yes. Um, <coughs> sorry this will actually go up. I, pff, actually, a couple days later than I originally wanted to, I had some issues with my new computer and hypercam, but hopefully I have figured them out. So, last time. Although you probably could watch the video, I will just explain a short bit. We had just saved Queen Lean. Yes, yes we did. It was most excellent. And now we are going to talk to her and probably take her back to the castle. So let us do that. Alright, this is exactly where we left off, at episode 6, and now I shall begin episode 7. You came to rescue me! Thank you, frog! The king awaits. Let us return to the castle. Yes, let us do that. This place smells funny. I thank the Chrono and Luca. Oh, yeah, it was nothing. Yes, thank you so much. Please join us. <laughs> All right, let's do, let's do that then. But first, I believe we should go open these chests. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! That's a dude. I can walk around. That's a dude. Okay, let's talk to him. <coughs> you. Thank you. That monster stuffed me in there. Oh, your highness! As you can see, I am undamaged. Um, all right, that's that's cool, I guess. And, and just walked on. All right, didn't thank you nothing. Gracious little bitch. Um, what do we got here? Uh, Mid either. Yes. Um, I'm unhappy with that treasure. Well, whatever. Let us go, Chrono, Luca, and Frog. Let's return to the castle. <laughs> okay, let's do it. Oh, oh, ooh, Otto, what was that? You had me worried, Lane. That no good Yakra impersonating me and kidnapping the Queen. We must create a criminal justice system in this kingdom to do away with such fiends. Ooh, frog music! <coughs> I failed to protect Queen Lane. I have disgraced thee. Frog! Goodbye. Forever. That seemed a little unnecessary. I mean, we have her, and... What? Where did, where did he go? Let's shut up! Okay, whatever. What do you gotta say, sir? That no good yacht crap impersonated me and kidnapped the queen! Okay, blah 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 blah, you just say the same thing. How about you, Kingy? Thank you, Chrono, but what, who was that girl we found in the canyon? Excellent question. Your timing was perfect. Who knows what would have happened had you not saved me? Well, um, you would have died, and lots of bad things would have happened. Yeah. Would have sucked big nuts. By the way, where's the girl who was taken from me? Oh yeah, I forgot all about Princess Nadia. Oh uh, yeah, oh uh, yeah. Chrono, where did Princess Nadia disappear? She may still be there. Where did she disappear indeed? Um, let's try this way. I know there was two towers, I can't remember which one. Hopefully it is this one, otherwise we have to go back to the other one, which is named because I have to spend more time running around like a moron. Oh, what do I got going on here? But you're a dead ringer for her. What? Which means the real lean was somewhere else. It's exactly as I thought. What the hell are you guys talking about? <laughs> dot 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 dot. <clears throat> I grow so tired of the gossip around here. Yeah, I suppose so. Hmm. Hmm. Dunk. Oh, I picked the right one! Ha <laughs> ha! Excellent. Uh, Meryl, you're back! Huh? What happened? <laughs> Princess Nadia! 
Rona! Yes, it is I. It was awful. I can't recall it at all. Somewhere dark. Cold. Cold dark. Cold dark. It's a new word. And lonely. Is that what it's like to die? Um, no. Because when you die, you just, you just, you're dead, you know? You stop feeling stuff. So, I don't really know where you were. Welcome back, Princess Nadia. What do you keep calling her that? Her name's Meryl, you dumb hoe. You risked your life to help me, too? Princess Nadia? Uh-oh. <laughs> I guess you guys figured it out, huh? Tee-hee-hee-hee-hee. <laughs> Sorry, Crono. I didn't mean to deceive you. Arr, grumble, grumble, grumble. Well, you know what? <coughs> I can forget about it. If we, uh, use that little thing up there, right? Yep. No. What's the sad music? Uh, why, why? I'm Princess Nadia, my father's king guardia, the 33rd. I really enjoyed being with you at the fair, but if you had known my identity... Nothing. What of changed? Prono, you wouldn't have shown me around the fair, right? Wrong! Wow, she got super excited. Oh, Chrono, that's why I like you. Yes, if you show that same excitement in bed, we'll be doing awesome. The real queen's safe, right? So let's go home, Chrono. Um, but we have this perfectly good thing we can use here, see? So you can just go in there and, uh... <sighs> Alright, ladies, fine. Maybe later. Let's go. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. Wait a minute. You guys changed it all? You guys... <coughs> you guys leaving? Wherever you're heading, be careful! No. Which means the real lean was somewhere else, exactly as I thought. Uh-huh. Hmm, the more I look at you, the stronger the resemblance. Uncanny! Oh wait, that was a guy. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! Ha Oops. That's awesome. Oh well, come on, Bruno. Things to do. People to kill. Actually, I don't know so much people, but random animals. Good times. Oh, okay. You're the real Queen Lean, huh? You really could be my twin. Well, you two better get along, or I'll be in big trouble. Ha <laughs> ha! I get what they're saying. I'll keep my fingers crossed. <laughs> Excuse me? Uh um, never mind. It's time to go. Yep. Ha <laughs> ha. Thank goodness you're safe. You may resemble Lean, but you sure don't act like her. Anyway. Why do I... Anyway, you've really helped me. Let me know how I can repay you. And, uh... <clears throat> if excuse me, I was practicing my ventriloquism. Yes. Wow, you could really be Lean's twin. That's what she said. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, whoa, Frog's still here. It was a fault of... It was a fault of mine which endangered the queen. I shall depart for good. Eek! I don't mean to start to you, but I am a frog. Ha ha ha. Indeed, your resemblance to the queen is uncanny. Ha ha. Now I'm just going to walk away. Ha ha ha. Chrono, you have potential to be a good swordsman. Ha ha. Goodbye. Man. What a jerk. Just leaves like that. Look up. Dot dot dot. <coughs> Froggy, you weren't such a bad guy either. Hmm. I suppose that is true. But he's gone, and we have things to do in other places. Oh, we have to go through the forest again, huh? Let us make it quick. Run, 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 run through the forest, running. Oh, let me check, because I haven't. Uh huh. Let's say here. Let's look at the characters. Nine, level seven, level eight. She needs a little bit of eleven then to catch up with the other two, but I guess they are pretty close. Powerhouse, weaklings. Powerhouse, weaklings. Ooh, but we have three elements. Ooh, enough of that. Let us move on. I can remember the way out of here. I should just be down in a. Oh no, chickens! Let us kill the chickens. Eaglets. But they kind of look like chickens, so I'll call them chickens. Hmm, let's see. Wait for that to load. Combine! Double technique fire whirl! 
Was it dive bombing? <laughs> Four, ten. Oh, this actually is kind of strong. Move over a little bit. I'm gonna hit all of them. I'm fine. Whatever. Hit these two. Yes. Yeah. Most excellent. Kill that one by smacking it with your crossbow. <laughs> and it worked. Very cool. Hmm. Yes, so I guess until I run into something new, I'll probably just cut out any battle I come across. <laughs> Although I don't really... I uh, might only run into one or two more along the way. That's okay. That's Residence. Residence! Residence! I'm Bonsa the Blacksmith. A fortunate bell for the Gwyn to present to his beloved Queen Lane. I lost to it when the Gwyn disappeared. I just couldn't keep working on the bell, but now it's back to business as usual. Oh, yeah. What do you guys say? My husband wants a daughter who's intelligent as she is beautiful. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, good luck to you people. Hmm, markets and resonances. Well, I think we already explored all that stuff, so... Let's see. They didn't specifically say, but I'm just guessing that to go back, we have to go back to where we came in. So, I believe that was this mountain up here. Can apparently it's a canyon, whatever. Let's go! And there's the guys kicking the ball around! Hmm, that kind of looks like fun. Hey, fellers, can I join you? No! What? Why not? Because you are humans, and humans are ugly and gross! Well, that's not a very nice thing to say. Oh yeah, well your mother isn't very nice. <laughs> My mother? How dare you, you sons of pigs! Ah, have at me. You will pay. Take. After I take a little damage, take. My awesome secret technique. Once... Get a little... No. Come on, come on. No, you're, you're walking away. That's not what you do there. Oh, right in the giblets. The guy is mocking me. And kicking stones at my face. You know what? He dies first. Raw Overkill. Crossbow shot, 42. Dead. Good job, team. Let us go. Um, I think I'll probably leave that one in because it was an extreme encounter. So let's continue on. What? What is this orange ball? Let's kill it. Stick him up, Kip. Because if you don't, Kip, you're gonna get a little bit of things stopping on me. You're gonna get a little bit of... Get a little bit of this. Get a bit of... Come on now. Get a bit of bang, bang. Bing, bing. Die. Apparently that new in it. I can't remember if I ran into that at last time, because it seems stronger than most enemies. At least I had a lot more health. But still went down pretty fast. Hmm, let's see. I'm down the rope. Um... This way? I can't go that way. Who's it up here? Ah, there we go. Oh, victory music! We have succeeded! What is this shiny little black ball? How do we get home? Good question. Your highness, her <coughs> princess we. Please call me Meryl! Yeah, do that. Well then, Meryl, observe! Whoa! Pretty princess power! Hmm. Wow! Luca, you're amazing! Oh boy! Ain't it the truth? Ah, oh, big headed lady mode! Enough of it! Stop! <coughs> oh, um, I mean. You know, for the false modesty, you have a real gift! I would trade my royal ancestry for your genius in a heartbeat! Um. I don't think that's a good idea, Meryl. I wouldn't do that. Well, if you say so. Anyway, I call this thing a gate. Because it's like a door? Ha! It's kind of a portal that takes you to the same location in a different era. Hmm. 
gates are very unstable, so I use the principal behind my telepod device. Oh, huh? Yeah. To create a gate key. Now we can use them as we please. Oh, boy. Why did this gate suddenly appear? Either the telepad had something to do with it, or something else made it. Hmm. Must ponder this. This is getting pretty weird. Let's at least head back to our own time. Good plan. All right, come in, Grono. Absolutely not. Okay, fine. <laughs> we we're back, baby. Phew, we're back. Excited mode activate. Chrono, Luca, why don't you come home with me to the castle? I'd like you to come over for dinner! That sounds fantastic! Sorry for putting you through all that, Meryl. Are you joking? That's the most fun I've had in months! And I have some new friends, too! Oh, yeah? Chrono, be a gentleman and take her home. I've got some work to do. Hey! Hey, where are you going? Come back here! <laughs> See you soon, Luca! Ah, women folk. Ah, well. Will you score me home, Chrono? I don't suppose I have much of a choice. Ah, such is the life of the hero. Hmm. Well, you know, I think this is the most fantastic spot to stop for now. Uh, I've accomplished the homecoming of our heroes, and even killed a few random forest creatures for fun. And because they also seem to make fun of us. Little pricks. So, That'll do it for episode 7 of Let's Play Chrono Trigger. This is Kirby Drop, signing out.